Kristen, come on in. Okay, oh. hi. Oh my God, you look so Welcome to the Kitchen and Jordan Show. Today we are actually doing a video, I guess over the next week or so, we're doing a video that we've wanted to do for a while, but we keep putting off because it's scary, okay? But basically this is a video where Kristen is going to try masculine fashion. I am. And I'm going to style her and find cute little outfits. I'm a very like high femme, like big curls, big hair. I'm very like, girl! But every so often, a little thought in my head will creep in and be like, but maybe not though. This is kind of a thing for like fat people. It's like when you're fat, you can only have one thing wrong. Okay. And that thing is being fat. And so you kind of have to conform to like a bunch of other standards so that like people don't get mad at you for being fat. That's why I think a lot of fat people kind of feel compelled to hide behind femininity as if that will save them. It will not, it will not save you. I talk a lot about how like I kind of put on like my Kristen costume when I get on camera. Yeah. I'm performing the character of Kristen today because this is not really what I like wear or look like in my normal life. <laughs> I'm like definitely like eh. The people who are nice to me will be like, you look good. The people who are mean to me will be like, you look bad and here are the specific reasons that you definitely will believe once you hear them. Guess what though? You do that, I find you <laughs> online, obviously. And I say something really mean to you. I think the people who dress mask are very hot, but I just do not think I'm gonna be one of them. I think I'm gonna look like a goober. I don't like want you to do anything that you don't wanna do, obviously. Well, yeah, but like- this Why is... do you want to do this video? Because I want to stretch myself and, and do new things. Also, like when we say masculine, we're not necessarily talking about gender things necessarily. We're sort of just talking about like masculine presentation in terms of like your clothing, like your hair, things like that. We're not gender bending is what we're saying. This is not in boy mode cosplay. Kristen is always dressed very femininely. And like, I think we're gonna try and explore some more masculine avenues of fashion. For me, and this is not the case for everyone, but for me personally, gender and clothes are very, very tied together. And I think a lot of that is because so much of my identity and personality and live experience is about my body. How I adorn my body to me is very, very tied into gender for me. Yeah. We're not <laughs> saying this is true for you. I can't stress this enough. This is about me. It's Let's say I was putting together like a dating profile. Yeah. I want you to put together the outfits that you would dress me in for those photos. I want you to pick hot outfits. I don't want you to pick like, I'm just doing this to make, cause it will look good and da -da 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 -da. Here's the thing, I try to style myself sometimes for videos and I come back looking like <laughs> a ex homosexual Republican. Like I don't know what's going on, but my outfits are just terrible and like somehow feel like they're betraying my identity. I'm not like a fashionista, we all know this. So this is as much of a journey for you as this for yeah, me. Yeah, but for the most part, I think it's gonna be a fun surprise for Kristen. And if it goes well, that'll be a fun surprise for me. <laughs> All right, so today's the day. The clothes I've ordered for Kristen have arrived. Kristen's in the other room right now as I sort of arrange my outfits, but I am really excited, okay? At first, when all they laid out all the clothes that I had got, I was like, I did a horrible job. This is awful. <laughs> all this stuff looks bad. But then I took my anti-anxiety medication and got to work, and I feel a lot more confident about the outfits I put together. So I'm excited for Kristen to see them. I'm excited to see Kristen in them. Hey, get back in your room. You're not allowed to see the clothes. Sorry. Get out of here. Go, Sorry. go. Sorry. Anyway, see you guys soon. Sound is speeding, you, Kristen. You would dare slap Fingy. <laughs> you would dare slap, stop slapping that Be thing. normal. Be normal, be normal. You be normal. <laughs> I didn't mean to slap you. Are, we so, are you rolling? Yes. <laughs> cool. Hi, everybody. Hi. That's Acam, by the way. Oh, wait, this is Acam. A -cam. <laughs> Oh my God, as you can see, Jen went shopping. Caveat before we start the clothing section of this video, we say mask fashion. What I guess we really meant is mask fashion looks for summer. For because summer. Because Kirsten gets very hot. If you hear ambient noise during all our videos, it's the air conditioning running because if I get warm, that's it. The channel ends. Yeah. When I was shopping for a lot of these items, the thing that I had to keep in mind was that I needed to buy mask stuff that also was like plus size. Yeah. And so we have a really fun butch bimbo friend who's also plus size who helped me out a lot and sent me a bunch of like links and inspo. She's okay with us describing her as that, yeah. by the way. I looked up a bunch of stuff and I got a lot of inspo from things she sent me. So thank you, Allison. I went to a few different shops. I got items from Abercrombie. <gasps> I got items from Torrid. Oh. I got items from Tomboy X. <gasps> I got items from Koto. Paxi. Ah. Let's talk about the bottoms. Obviously I don't wear dresses or skirts. So I got Kristen shirts and pants and bottoms and things like that. So we could make the outfits that way. So it's like, what if my 
So it's weekend at Bernie's. So this item, obviously a pair of shorts, you think, mm -hmm. but what they actually are is a pair of swim trunks. <gasps> so you ever want to just like throw on a sports bra and some swim trunks and okay. go swimming, which is how I basically do it? That would give you this. You can wear them as swim trucks, but they're also shorts. Right. I also got you these cute shorts. Yes, these colors are maybe a little bit more femmy than you would expect, but actually like colors can be for anybody. You know, it's more of a vibe. These are a really good basic. I really paid attention to the material they use because this okay. is, if you feel it, it's a really light material. Oh, it's like a linen. What did you think of the bottoms I got you? Uh, I feel like this is a departure, but like it's not that this is a huge departure. I'm curious about this. This is less structured than I thought it would be. I guess it makes sense because it is summertime. The thing that's kept me away from mask fashion for a long time is I don't like being warm. Which is what I was thinking when I bought this stuff. Yeah, it's, I guess it makes sense that like masculine people still have to dress for the weather. Because in my mind, I'm just like, well, you all just go nude. <laughs> No, that's not what happens. Moving on to the tops. So this is, it's a vest hoodie. I don't know, I just think it's kind of like skatery and cool, but also it'll help you because you don't, it'll be less hot because there's no sleeves. Mm -hmm. So I feel like it's a good winter jacket item. Ooh, this next item I'm really excited about because it's really personal to Kristen. Wha-bam! <laughs> In case you haven't seen our past videos, when I was a teenager, I was obsessed with Weezer. I, I written some, I can't even say that without laughing. Weezer real person fanfiction. I had written some Weezer real person fanfiction. It was well known. I have not been obsessed with Weezer in I want to say 20 years, something like that. And I thought what a great time to dip back into that little obsession. I know, right? So this is like another baseball t-shirt I got her. Feel the material, it's super lightweight. That is very soft. This is another tank top. This is Ooh. also from Tomboy X. I thought this was really cute. This I am really excited about. So this is from Abercrombie. Yeah. I actually have a button down shirt just like this. In addition to like these tops, okay. I also got Kristen. Oh, some Burkles. I didn't want to spend the budget on Burks. So, <laughs> they're knocking socks. I wear Birkenstocks probably every day. And then I also got you this other cute pair of slides because everyone knows I love a good pair of sandals. I love a good pair of slides. So here's the thing. I normally like to cinch waist and this is all very like boxy. I'm not saying all masked people dress boxy. I guess I dress pretty boxy. And I was like, box time for Kristen. You'll notice there's, there's a one and two hats. Why are there two hats? Okay, so actually this is the hat that I bought for you. And this is the hat that I like so much I bought it for me. Oh, so this one's actually my hat. Indeed. And D this one is for Kristen. So, so this is all you have, right? Yes, and then, I, no it's not. Hold on, oh, hold on. Okay. Okay, I got him, I got him, I'm coming back. This is like a fun little, kind of like an Easter egg part of the video, because you're not gonna see these on camera, but it's important to me that you wear them to really get the vibe down. Okay. So, I got you little cute boy short undies. Oh, they have little dinosaurs on them. I do. If these don't work, throw them in the garbage. We don't, don't even see look, them on camera. They but look pretty cute though. We're gonna cut, Kristen's gonna get into the first outfit. And when you see her next, she's gonna be looking real cutie pie. Woo, all right, we're back. Kristen's in her first outfit. Kristen, come on in. Okay, oh. hi. Oh my God, you look so cute. Oh my gosh, what? Oh my God, I feel like I'm looking at like a mirror image of myself. I think this is really cute. I think it looks really good on you. I think you look freaking adorable, but tell me how you feel. I have thoughts. <laughs> <laughs> Just remember, I'm sensitive. I know. Actually, though, it doesn't matter about my feelings because I want you to be comfortable in the outfit. I think everything on me is cute. I don't think these four things go together. Really? I think this shirt and this, these shorts go together. Yeah, they do. And I think that this shirt and these shoes go together. They totally do. I don't and think- And those four items go together. It's like kind of a weird double date happening. But in terms of fit, like, how do you feel? Do you feel comfortable? Like, well, here's the thing. It's impossible for me to tell whether or not I feel comfortable because I'm so uncomfortable wearing things that don't match. <laughs> Go get a different t-shirt and we'll see. Well, but everything else has to stay the same. Yes. Okay, I see what you mean. <laughs> Great. It's a win for you. You put together most of this outfit. Question, like, yeah. in terms of just like this, all the clothes like being kind of baggier, yeah. how does that make you feel like, are you okay with it? I'm okay with it, because like this isn't baggy. This actually isn't baggy. This is the part that's baggy. Right. It feels okay. I think you look really cute. Oh, thank you. Yeah, I think I did a really good job. You did do a really good, you did a great job. Ready for outfit number two? Yes. Woo! Oh. Kristen, you're cute to get in here, and I can already see that you look freaking cute as hell. Hi. 
Hi, everybody! So, this is you wearing that, like, cute little, like, sweatshirt, rain jacket situation vest. And you have a cute little t-shirt underneath it, and then fun little shorts. Based on your expression, I can tell you have thoughts. How do you feel in this outfit? I feel like I'm wearing a life vest. <laughs> As is, you feel like you're in a life vest. What would you change to make this more comfortable for you? Honestly, I would do some editing. Yeah, go change. Okay, yeah, let's, yeah, yeah, go yeah. make the change. Yeah. yeah, this looks better. <laughs> okay, I would do this. Show them the fun underwear. Yeah, so I'm wearing the fun underwear. <laughs> and the thing is, it's like, cause the underwear rides so high and these ride so low. I just feel like these are kind of the star. And like, Those are great shorts. And like, I don't want to overwhelm the shorts with like other stuff. So like, this can just be like my casual, like. I mean, this is a perfect, like, yeah. Beach day, pool day outfit. Yeah, like this is just this is a long line sports bra I just own. Here's the thing, I'm hiding less of my body, so scary. But like, I'm hiding less of my body, so we might as well lean into the fact that these are high and these are low. Yeah. You know? Part of this video is like to give you more pieces that could be more masculine, but yeah. also it's like I want you to like wear stuff that still makes you feel comfortable. Yeah. So I feel like this is a good compromise. Next outfit. Next outfit. Yeah. Come out, Kristen. Let's see this third outfit. <gasps> my third outfit. You're so cute. <laughs> Like a child. I think this is so cute. You look like a boy scout. Let's talk about what I like. I, I like, I think this is cool. I like this. Shorts and the tank top, yeah. The fake Birkenstocks, obviously. The fake Birkenstocks, I think, go fine with it. I like the hat, not with this. I think it's a lot of earth tones, and this is a lot of like, what? I don't know, man. I just feel like you look like a perfect, like, summer day. For the record, I think this hat would go, s no, actually, I don't think it would go either. This is, well, this is my hat. Do you just want this to have matching hats? We have matching hats now. I just want well, Hat touch. <laughs> The only note I would I have is I would take this off. I reject but, that. I reject that note. So overall, how has this experience been? These honestly are different silhouettes that I'm used to, but the thing is is that this is all very calm. Comfortable. That's actually a big part of all this. Everything I wear is designed to be comfortable as possible. And when shopping for you, that was the philosophy I also had in my head. I could wear this tonight. Do you want to? Would you keep yeah. the hat on? I'm not gonna okay. All right, which was your favorite outfit of the three? Um, My favorite outfit of the three, I think it's close between this one and the second one. Because of the hat, this is my favorite of the outfits. These are great, you did well. Thank you. Okay. Summer Mass Fashion, thanks for watching. I'm so glad you liked it. it is. Good. Okay, all right. All right, we're done. See you guys next time. Bye. Mm -hmm. Smoochy, smoochy.